industrial targets. Little was reported about the fate of the people of the city. In May 1946, an American journalist, John Hersey, was asked by the New Yorker magazine to go to China and Japan and write a series of articles. Hiroshima was to be one of his subjects. Nearly a year after the bombing, he found the city devastated. The people still dazed and suffering. The story he brought back so moved the editors of the New Yorker that although they had intended it to be a serial, they devoted an entire issue to it, adding only an introduction. They wanted to show clearly the human consequences of using such a terrible weapon. As a book, it was translated into many languages. Newspapers all over the world serialized it. Radio stations broadcast it. Hersey told for the first time the story of the people of Hiroshima. He took six survivors, six people who had lived through the unimaginable. There was a young girl, Miss Sasaki, aged 20, an office worker. There was a young doctor, also called Sasaki, but not related to her. There was a Dr. Fuji, who owned a small private hospital. A German priest, Father Kleinsorger. And there was Mrs. Nakamura, a working woman with three children whose soldier husband had been killed in the war, and Reverend Tanimoto, a Methodist minister with a wife and baby. Their stories provide a detailed record of that time. A hundred thousand people were killed by the atomic bomb. These